What's up, everybody? Got another video for you. I had a question. Uh, what did I think about fat burners? And to be quite honest with you, I don't use them. I've looked into them and read about them, studied them a little bit, and I bought one for somebody, and uh, they were using this one. I just, I've always gone with the cheap stuff on this. I don't look at the Lipo 6 and the, uh, the Oxy Elite Pros and stuff like that. I think that stuff's a little too, too hard. I mean, this right here, if I can read the ingredients to you, has caffeine and hydrous, which is the chemical form of caffeine, has yerba mate, green tea extract, this chai de burgi, don't know what that is, cayenne, ginger root, white willow bark. And the reason why I bought this one is because it has very few ingredients in it. Now everybody thinks about thermogenic. When you hear the word thermogenic, you hear thermal, you think heat, you think burning. So I think that's why they be putting that word up there. And basically, this product is for somebody that is already in tune with their body. They're, they've cut down to the, a low percent of body fat and they want to burn off that last little bit of uh, fat on their body. This isn't for somebody that's overweight and they're trying to pop a few pills and, and, and it's just going to melt the fat off. These pills don't do that. It's about your diet, your nutrition, it's your working out, it's your lifestyle. It's not about a pill. Now yes, these help because it spikes your, your metabolism. You know, if you're, if you're dialed down and you're in a caloric deficit, you don't have any energy. I mean, you're, you're wasted. So if you put one of these in there and you got the caffeine and you got the, the green tea extract and a few of these other ingredients, it's going to spike your energy levels. It's going to spike your metabolism. And yeah, you could burn a little bit more fat. Now, the question I had uh, in my, my log here was, you know, should I use one of these while I work out with a pre-workout? And I'm going to tell you no. You do not need to work out with this with a pre-workout. Pre-workouts have enough stimulus in it. Unless you're using one without stimulants, you know, you can go ahead and pop this. But then again, why not just use one that has stimulus in it? Because that's what you're going to get out of this. So I wouldn't use this for a workout session. Not, not mean a workout session, but a, a weightlifting session. If I'm going to do this, it would be with CrossFit, uh, running, you know, cardio. That's what I would use this for. I wouldn't use it as I'm working out and pumping iron. This stuff, if you get a real powerful one, will, will, it's, it's going to do exactly what a pre-workout might do. It's going to cause your heart rate to go up, you're going to be sweating, you can get the jitters. But uh, this one, you want to get one that's got all pretty much natural ingredients. And this one doesn't because it's got that caffeine and hydrous in it. Now, this, uh, I did a review on this product here. It's Fit X Trainer by MHP. This actually has a, a, a blend in it that's supposed to be, you know, fat burning, thermogenic type of, of a blend in it. I'll read the ingredients to you. It has those raspberry ketones, which is the newest, hottest thing for fat burning, because you heard it from Dr. Phil. And it's got some green tea extract. Of course, that's going to supply your caffeine to get you a little, get a little spike of uh, energy. It's got some, some other extracts, some crap I can't pronounce, but it says on this actual trainer here, increase post-workout fat burning with trainer's clinically dosed thermogenic blend. There's the word, thermogenic, because they want you to think melt. They want you to think heat, burn, you know, melt the fat off. So thermogenic, let's drop that word. You can break down more body fat and continue to burn up to 12% more calories for up to four hours after you work out. This is what this is claiming to do. Now, why not just drop your calories to burn fat? All right, just drop your calories. Don't eat as much. You'll start losing weight. That's the natural way to do these things. I mean, everybody wants a quick fix, but if I was gonna do a pre-workout and a fat burner, I would probably go with this product right here since it has best of both in it. But unfortunately, I took this, and it's really not for weightlifting. It's really for CrossFit, which is a little bit of weightlifting, but it's not for hardcore weightlifting. So CrossFit is more of an endurance, strengthening, and cardio type 
is what I think. So I stopped using this, but I've been giving it to some people around my place here, and they're loving it. They're runners, and you know they're cardio type people, and they're like, "Wow, that stuff is amazing." I, I ran faster than I did before. My times are dropping, so it's good, but it's just not for what I use it for. But it does have a thermogenic blend in it. So like I was saying, guys, and the guy that had the question, sorry, I forget your name off the top of my head. Um, fat burners do work. They do work at a, for a short period of time. This isn't a long time thing that you want to throw in your body and keep taking every day and hope these pounds are going to melt off because it's not going to happen. This is for the end of your cycle, your cutting phase, and you want to lose that last 2% that you're trying to get down to. You're at 10, you're trying to get to 8, you know. You probably want to take one of these because you're really low on your calories at this point and you want to get some energy in you so you can keep going. There's where you're going to use your thermogenic blend at. As far as if you're, you know, 20 pounds overweight, you, you can forget this. You got to start with your diet, your lifestyle, and start working out and doing some cardio. And then when you get down to a percentage where you just plateau, go ahead and pop a couple of these, man. It might help you out. So as far as your question there, I would not double up on one of these and a pre-workout that has stimulants it's just way too much way too much man it's dangerous if you ask me so that's my thought on it that's my take on it and if you have any more questions let me know see y'all next time I'm about to head to the gym myself